A multi-million dollar expansion of Logan Airport's International Terminal just opened quietly. With no formal announcement, the opening of the new building, approved five years ago, is surprising a mm. lot of travelers at Terminal E. If you've been near Logan Airport, no doubt that you've noticed it. The giant red terminal looks like a flying saucer, yes. really. WBZ's Christina Hager shows us all of the new additions from this long-awaited project. Under this sweeping new shiny red roof, a Logan Airport expansion in the works for the last five years quietly opened to the public this week. Why do you like it? What does it remind you of? Well, it's a shape. What's, uh, I, don't, I can't tell really what the shape is, but I like it. What does it look like? A spaceship? Kind of looks like a boat. Inside, for the first time, passengers are using this new lounge in Terminal E. Looks modern to me, yeah. And behind this glass window, a restricted area for anyone without a ticket. But you can see passengers heading to four new gates that just began operating Tuesday, an area Massport wouldn't let us see. It's sort of a shame for the public not to see this unless they're flying through it. David Slotnick is a reporter for the travel website The Point Guy. It's just very wide open. Um, if you look right through there, that's actually the Delta Lounge. He got a sneak peek, but he was restricted to just this spot. He took this picture of Delta Airlines' new Sky Club. This is the first impression that people see. And, you know, Boston is obviously continuing to grow as a major city. There are more international flights than there were. There are more domestic flights than there were. More space, new restaurants, and now a total of 16 gates in this terminal alone means less time for people sitting on planes that are taxiing or parked on the tarmac. Really is sort of the start of a new era in travel, not just here, but around the country. You know, for Boston to be part of that, I think is really important. A Massport spokesperson says there is a big grand opening plan, but not until this fall. And that's because she says the project isn't completely done yet. There are still concessions being built here. At Logan Airport, Christina Hager, WBZ News. All right.